After parts of Cebu City went underwater last week, a project engineer said a road widening project to include the existing drainage system should have been implemented before the construction of the Mambaling underpass began. Here's Jeremy Librea for the details. A 15 million peso worth of road widening project that would include improvement of the existing drainage system should have been made before the Mambaling underpass was constructed. This is what project engineer Roy de la Cruz revealed amid the flooding incidents in the area. Another project worth 18 million pesos was also intended for the improvement of the drainage system perpendicular to the underpass of the area near Shopwise, where the water will be carried going to Tagunol. De La Cruz said the implementation of the projects was delayed due to the right-of-way concerns, adding that there was a failure in bidding for the road widening project. He clarified, however, that the flooding only occurs at the side of the underpass and not inside the tunnel. The project engineer also said that there are pumps installed in the underpass that can be used if the water reaches a certain level. The Department of Public Works and Highways has already deployed two of its personnel to monitor the area. Mambaling Barangay Captain Hines Abellana said there is an unfinished drainage in the area that causes the flooding. As a remedy, Abellana said they have been conducting cleanup every Saturday. The Department of Engineering and Public Works is also declogging around 30 manholes in the area as a temporary solution to the flooding. Jura Libria, News Bits Tonight.